In our featured video today, we're going to learn the symptoms of a bad EGR valve. But first, let's refresh our understanding of how it works and what it does in our car. The EGR valve's purpose is to recirculate a portion of the exhaust gases back into the intake manifold. This process helps lower the combustion temperature, which is important because high temperatures lead to the formation of NOx, nitrogen oxides. By reducing the temperature, the production of NOx is minimized. When an EGR valve malfunctions, it can present symptoms in two different ways. It can be stuck open or it can be stuck closed. Now, let's look into the common symptoms of a malfunctioning EGR valve. Symptom number one, engine stalls and runs rough while idling. If the EGR valve is stuck open, too much exhaust gas enters the engine intake, depriving the engine of fresh air. This can cause the MAF sensor to detect a lack of incoming air, which can lead to stalling at low speeds. Typically, the engine will struggle to maintain idle RPM and may experience increased vibrations or severe shaking. Symptom number two, having your check engine lights on. This is likely the simplest way to identify a faulty EGR valve. Look for diagnostic trouble codes, DTCs, ranging from P0400 to P0409. You can have these codes read at most auto parts stores, which often offer this service for free. Symptom number three, knocking sound. The primary function of the EGR valve is to lower the combustion temperature. When the EGR valve is stuck closed, the engine cylinder temperature increases because the fuel burns more efficiently with an abundance of fresh air. This temperature rise can cause a knocking or pinging sound if it exceeds the manufacturer's designed limits, and sometimes the engine can overheat. Symptom number four, failed emissions test. A stuck-closed EGR valve can cause this issue. It prevents exhaust gases from entering the combustion process, leading to increased chamber temperatures and more pronounced engine knocks. Excessive knocking can result in failing emissions tests due to elevated NOx emissions. So when the EGR malfunctions, it interrupts the combustion process and impacts the emission levels, which can potentially cause your vehicle to fail emissions tests. Symptom number five, low performance from the engine. If the EGR valve is stuck open, it allows excessive exhaust gas into the engine, which can starve the engine of fresh air. This can noticeably affect performance during acceleration when the engine requires more fresh air for peak performance. Also, the increased exhaust gas can interrupt the fuel injection rates, which can compromise the engine efficiency. Symptom number six, lack of acceleration. The cause of this issue could be a stuck open EGR valve. When the EGR valve remains open, it continuously reintroduces exhaust gases into the combustion chamber. These gases displace air, reducing the amount available for optimal engine performance. This limitation is likely why you're experiencing poor acceleration. Symptom number seven, altered fuel economy. Again, if your EGR valve is already faulty, it messes up how the engine burns fuel, so you might have to press harder on the gas pedal to move like you normally would. This can really bring down how far you can go on a tank of gas. Symptom number eight, rough idle. When the EGR valve is stuck open, it occupies space within the combustion chamber with exhaust gases, leaving less room for efficient air fuel combustion. This improper combustion can cause noticeable vibrations in your car. Symptom number nine, fuel smell around the car. If the EGR isn't working right, the engine doesn't burn fuel well because the air to fuel mix is off. This can make the exhaust smell like fuel more than usual, especially when you start the car or when the engine's cold. There you have it, the nine common symptoms of a faulty EGR valve. If you're noticing any of these signs and suspect your EGR valve might be the issue, it's best to have it checked by a mechanic familiar with your vehicle's system. They can diagnose the problem accurately and recommend the necessary repairs or replacements. And to give you an idea on average, the cost of parts for an EGR valve ranges from $100 to $400. Labor costs can also influence the total expense, typically ranging from $100 to 
depending on the complexity of the installation and local labor rates. So, you can expect the total cost of replacing an EGR valve to range from approximately $200 to $700. It's advisable to still get estimates from local mechanics or service centers for a more accurate idea of the cost specific to your vehicle and location. If you find videos like this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe so we can assist you. Fix it!